I think you're 10 win potential, but anything other than winning the division, your quarterback is still Derek Carr. That's all I'm saying. I, I think the Saints are back. I think last year was a bad year, even though you finished strong. But damn it, it's Derek Carr. Y'all gonna have to. Derek Carr gonna have to show me. I don't care if niggas is shooting. It's all about the clap back. Get your boss whack from his funeral on Snapchat. Ha! You now tuned into the bad guy. Math like. All right, look. Shout out to the Saints, man. Shout out to the Saints. Listen, I literally stopped doing Saints content because of Derek Carr. I hate Derek Carr, okay? Derek Carr is, is, is trash, okay? This is a known fact. This man is trash, all right? And he is the only thing <laughs> that, that, that just keeps me from going all in on the Saints. I, Saints fans, y'all was booing his ass for a reason. So you can't call me crazy. Alright, Saints fans, you cannot call me crazy because y'all was booing his ass. So here's what I'm going to say about the Saints. Like, you know how Denver can only be but so bad because they play a mile high? Seattle can only be but so bad because they play up there with the 12th man. I feel like the Saints is one of those teams that because of how great of a home field they have in New Orleans and the Mercedes Dome, I feel like they're always going to be competitive. They're always going to be competent. Dennis Allen might be a horrible head coach, but his defense is always legit. Like, I can't, like, Dennis Allen's never going to have a bad defense. So as long as the Saints are playing in New Orleans and Dennis Allen's got that defense humming, they're never going to be bad. They're never going to be great until they get the next Drew Brees. Or not even the next Drew Brees. If Derek Carr can keep doing what he's doing, then they'll be fine. Kamara is still got it. This dude, shit, Rashid Shahid is nasty. I mean, they need to talk about him with the Tyreek Hills and the, and the freaking Malik Neighbors and all these other, and, and Marvin Harrison, like he's that fast. And you still got Chris Olave, who, who's a stud. So it, it's like, I'm looking at the Saints and I'm like, I love everything about the Saints. I'm just not sold on Derek Carr yet. Oh, man, that's the only thing I don't like about the Saints is your quarterback is Derek Carr. This is the same dude who in Vegas couldn't win games with Josh Jacobs, Darren Waller, Devontae Adams, Hunter Renfro, and one of the best pass rushers in the league on his defense. It's still that guy. It's still the same guy who cries in the huddle when he gets sacked too much. It's still him. It's still the same guy who literally cries in the huddle and has watery eyes in press conferences because he gets sacked too much. It's Derek Carr. Your quarterback is Derek Carr and Saints fans. I still love y'all. Y'all know y'all my side bitch. Y'all know y'all my bad bitch that I creep in hotels with. You know I love who that nation. Y'all embraced me before Giants fans embraced me. Giants fans hated me for years because I shitted on Eli Man and bum ass. So it's just like I love Saints fans. And that's why I'm telling you from the bottom of my black, black heart. Tread carefully. Enjoy it. You beat the Cowboys. You beat the Panthers. I'm not like. I'm just saying. It's Derek Carr. Tread carefully. Enjoy it. I'm not saying you're going to be bad. I'm not. That ain't what I'm saying. Because even if Derek Carr start playing like Derek Carr, you still have a great defense. You got Alvin Kamara. You still have enough to win. I'm just saying. This ain't the 09 Saints. Drew Brees ain't walking through that door. All right. This ain't 2009. This ain't 2018 when you got the, the no call and should have went to the Super Bowl. This ain't that because your quarterback is Derek Carr. 
Now, if you had a, a quarterback we can trust, the hell yeah. We could talk about Super Bowl and, and competing against the Niners and all that shit. But it's Derek Carr. That's my only concern, Saints fans. It's Derek Carr, man. But, like, I, I look at this division, and I'm thinking, why can't the Saints win the division? Even with Derek Carr, I still feel like you're better than the Falcons, and you're better than the Bucks, and we're not even going to talk about the Panthers. Now, I will say this, though, as far as Carolina goes. Carolina's probably going to be a tad bit more competitive because they got Andy Dalton. That's the only thing I say about Carolina. I'm not saying Carolina going to win games. It still might only go like 2-15. and 15. I'm just saying. Carolina might be slightly more competitive with Andy Dalton. I'm not sure Bryce Young is, it, it, it should be playing in the NFL. I'm just being honest with you. So, like I said, we're we going to see, man. I think you're better than the Falcons. I think you're better than the Buccaneers. The Bucs can't block for Baker. Did y'all actually watch how they beat the Lions on Sunday? The like the dude Aiden Hutchinson was about to set the single game sack record on Baker Mayfield for crying out loud. I can only imagine what the Saints pass rush is going to do to Baker Mayfield. So I'm not really worried about the division. I, I, I could say two weeks into the season, I could say the Saints should win the division. I, I, I give you that. I, I, two weeks into the season, I can say the Saints are going to win the division. But is anything other than that, your quarterback is still Derek Carr. I don't know what you want me to do with that. I think you're 10 win potential. But anything other than winning the division, your quarterback is still Derek Carr. That's all I'm saying. I, I think the Saints are back. I think last year was a bad year, even though you finished strong. But damn it. It's Derek Carr. Y'all going to have to. Derek Carr going to have to show me. Derek Carr going to have to show me. He going to have to prove me wrong, B. He going to have to prove me wrong because I'm not with the bullshit. I done, I done seen Derek Carr fail with better rosters than what he got on the Saints. I'm just saying. I done seen this dude fail with prime Crabtree, prime Amari Cooper, Marshawn Lynch at running back. Like this dude done failed with some talent. Let's not act like Derek Carr ain't never wet the bed with a bunch of talented, skilled position players around him. I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. There's a reason y'all were booing him, Saints fans. Do not forget that. I just want all Saints fans to know. There is a reason you were booing this dude. Okay? So, I get it. You're 2-0. I think y'all done scored on every possession. Uh... Yeah, I think y'all haven't, have y'all punted yet? I think y'all scored on 15 out of 15 possessions. I think that was a stat. But at the end of the day, man, it's nice to see who that nation hyped. It's nice to go on my comment sections to see the who that's and everything. I missed y'all. I did. Like I said, Derek Carr, I had to, I had to leave y'all asses alone. Y'all gave Derek Carr that money. I had to leave y'all alone. I had to leave you alone. But I mean, um... We shall see, man. Time will tell. Like I said, I think y'all can. I think y'all can win the division, even if Derek Carr goes back to being Derek Carr. I think y'all can win the division. But he's Derek Carr, okay? Just, just he's Derek Carr. I don't know. I, just, I don't know what you want me to do with that. But anyway, that's it. That's all. Hit the like button, hit the sub button, drop FUs in the comments if you rock it with me, and stay vicious. Dismiss. <laughs>